We help lots of people transform the way that they feel about driving to become calm and confident drivers. And that includes people who are learning to drive, as well as people who've already passed their driving test but don't feel as confident as they'd like to. We've noticed two common themes among those who come to us for help. And those are not only how confident they feel in their own driving ability, but also whether they feel able to drive independently and make their own good driving decisions. So, which type of driver do you most closely associate with? Perhaps you feel you're a brave beginner. Maybe you haven't started to drive yet. Or maybe you're in the early stages of your driving lessons where everything still feels really new and a little bit scary. It feels like there's so much still to learn and you're relying on your instructor to tell you what to do when and you're only managing to do a few of the early basics independently. Or perhaps you relate more to our doubtful driver. You might feel confident in your driving skills and happy with the things that you can do. This might be whether you're still a learner and you're happy with the things that you've learned in your lessons, or it could be that you have passed your driving test and you feel happy with the actual driving a car. However, maybe what you do struggle with is making decisions. When to join a roundabout, when to pull out at a junction, which lane to get in, which way are you going? If you're struggling with these driving decisions, it may be that you're constantly asking your driving instructor or if you've passed your test, it may be that you're asking your passenger for help. You might also be worrying a lot about what other drivers on the road think about you and your driving. Or maybe you're more like our distressed driver. You feel happy driving independently and making your own driving decisions and you know that you can drive. However, sometimes you don't feel that you can drive. Maybe stress, nerves or anxiety creep up on you or hit you unexpectedly. If you're still learning to drive, you might feel confident within your driving lessons. But then the minute you think about your driving test, you start to feel anxious and panicky. Or maybe if you've already passed your driving test, it may just be that sometimes you feel blindsided with panic or anxiety or nerves for no apparent reason. Perhaps you're driving automatically and because you no longer have to concentrate so hard on your driving is leaving room for thinking about other things. And when you think about those other things, that can make you feel nervous or anxious. And actually what you'd really like to learn is how to manage those feelings when they do come around. Or finally, perhaps you relate more to our confident cruiser. You're driving independently, you're making your own decisions, you know that you can drive and you feel confident. And when stress or nerves do hit, you know how to manage them effectively so that they don't impact on your driving. So, what type of driver are you? And if you find that you relate to our brave beginner, our doubtful driver or our distressed driver, why not have a look at our resources to see how we can help?